Hey guys, this is Arif and you are watching my channel Eflim by Arif. Today I have a very interesting transition tutorial of Ben TK. This is actually a slight transition and I am gonna make you understand everything step by step inside Adobe Premiere Pro. Here in Adobe Premiere Pro, I have 12 video clips and all are the best part of the video. I organize all the video clips here in timeline one by one and length of these video clips are one and a half second. So guys, to make this transition tutorial, I'll only apply transform effect. Before applying transform effect, first of all, I have to resize all of the clips. I keep the first video length on and half second. For second video, I'm gonna make its length on second. So I'm gonna take the razor tool and make a cut like here. Now I'm going back and select selection tool, then select this and hit the delete key from the keyboard. For the third video clip, I'm gonna make its length less than on second. Okay. Now I'm going back to take razor tool. I'm gonna make a cut like here. Now go back and select selection tool. Select this, hit the delete key from the keyboard to delete this portion of the video. Again click on this blank area and hit the delete key from the keyboard to delete this blank area. Length of this video will be less than third video. Now take razor tool and make a cut like here. Then hit the V key from the keyboard for selection tool. Now select and delete. Also de delete this space. For fifth video, its size will be less than previous video. Now hit the C key from keyboard for razor tool and hit the V key from keyboard for selection tool and cut the unnecessary part of the video. For this video, its size will be around 8 frames. After 8 frames later, I delete this unnecessary portion of the video. Now I am moving forward 8 frames to the right and hit the C key for razor tool and cut this unnecessary part of the video. Do the same thing for rest of the video. I am skipping this part so you don't have to wait. So guys now I am moving over there in the effects and searching for transform effect. After find out this effect, I am gonna apply this effect to the first video clip. Ok let's do it. Now make sure that first video clip is selected. Now go over there in effect controls and move this time indicator at the very beginning frame. Now scroll down and I am gonna add a couple keyframes of position and scale. Now I am moving 4 frames to the right and click this to add another 2 keyframes. Now I am moving 2 frames to the right and again click this point to add keyframes. Now I am going back to fast keyframes and make scale value 120. Go to the next frame and make its value again 120. Now we can uh, move the time indicator to see the very fast uh, animation that we have done just right now. Well, it's time for position. Now make sure time indicator at the very beginning frame. Now we have to change the X position. Drag this video to the right. Now move the time indicator and see the full animation. So guys here is something missing like uh, natural motion blur. So to apply this effect we have to scroll down and uncheck this first at first. Then shutter angle value. I'm gonna make its maximum value 360 degree. Ok now we can move the time indicator again. So this is our final animation. To make this animation smooth we have to select all the keyframes at first. Then right click. Go there and select VZA. Now the animation is better than before. Apply this transition to the FD clips. Just copy this transform effect. Now select the second clip. Just hold down the control key plus hit VK at the same time to paste this effect to the second clip. Now do the same thing for the third clip. Just hold down the control key and hit the V key at the same time to apply this transform effect. Ok, do the same thing for every single clip except the last one. So guys, this is the whole process of making slight transition like Ben TK. I think guys, you all figured it out how to make this transition. You can apply sound effect to make it better but I'm not gonna do right now. 
to make this transition smooth go to the sequence and click render into out to render this transition after rendering playback will be much better so guys this is the today's slight transition of band tk i hope you really enjoy this transition see you later in the next tutorial till then goodbye